Hey surveys and welcome back to K Pop Schools. Schools. I'm Paige. I'm Kate. And we are back, guys, making our way through our huge list of new comebacks and new releases as always. Uh up next we have our girls A Pink and their brand new comeback, D and D. So, um, we've only checked out what, one or two songs? We've listened to Dilemma. I think that might be the only one. I think that's the only one that I remember uh, because it was a high fashion concept and I remember they were all in dresses and we were like, yes. So I I listened to like pretty much all of their other songs. Yeah. At one point, I was a huge (laughs) Pink stand. So she knows them much better than I do. Uh, She's heard more of the music I've literally only seen and heard one of their songs. I know all the members. Um, And I think I liked your bias? Yes, you liked Ha Young and Unji. Ha Young and Unji, okay. Ha is my bias. Yes. I really liked Ha Young's voice. I remember that. Um, and then when we checked out Unji Solo, mm-hmm. I really liked her as well, so. I'm excited to see what this one's gonna be like. Listen, we've been cracking up over the title because literally all we can think of when we read D&D is, uh, D&D. Dungeons and Dragons. Dungeons and Dragons, because we're big Dungeons and Dragons nerds. Um, I literally watched full-on four-hour videos on YouTube of people Same. playing it, Critical so. Role. Critical Role. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> Shout out to Critical Role if they ever say this. By them. <laughs> Not <Yeah>. at all. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so I'm super excited, I know Kate is, um, but before we jump in, we're gonna leave a link to our Patreon down below in the description box, we hope you come over and check us out, we do live stages, drum reactions, variety shows, dance practices, you can join our Discord, basically everything Kate do here on YouTube, we also post free videos over there, for you guys to watch on our channel, because we're not gonna make you pay for this too free, that's just stupid. Speaking of our Patreon, we're currently watching Room BTS, Produce 101 the series, Season 1, The Isaacs, Strong Woman, Do Bong Soon, Got Seven's Heart Carry, I have one segment called Pint Size Director Dramas of My Own, and I only have three more episodes left of the show that I'm currently watching before I start the next one. Uh, we have movie reactions, album reviews, so much fun content going on over there. Uh, we also blah, 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 have words. I lost that. I was so good, and then I lost it. Uh, we're also, we've been pre-filming a ton of shows for you guys um, that will take place to some of the shows that we are currently filming once they're done, um, and we're also just wanting to get ahead so that we'll have steady stream of content when we get slammed by comebacks. Um, also, if you can follow us over on Twitter, our handle will be on screen. Hiccups. Uh, we post every single day over there, videos dropping tests today, update we're doing here on our channel. All right, you ready? I'm ready. Pop this up. By the way, it just popped in my head, too, because I was talking about Twitter. Um... Hui Young went live, I guess, either early today or something like that, and he was like, yeah, I haven't been in here a while, but it's because I'm like, I've, I've gained weight, but, you know, I'm like, boy, where? Where is this weight that you have gained? You look gorgeous no matter what you do. Like, what? Sorry. Off topic, but I had to, I had to get that out because I was like, what, bitch, where? <laughs> I know. Idols are always like, oh, I'm so fat, and it's like, no, you're not. I'm like, look at him, I'm like, you're, just because your face is slightly, like, your cheeks are a little bit more full, like, you look handsome. <laughs> <laughs> what? Where? Where is this weight that you said you gained? <laughs> anyway, back to this video. Sorry, my little rant over. A pink D and D. Here we go. I was gonna say, I'm like, I'm pretty sure I recognize that voice because she's got the deep authority tone. I love Chowdhury. They looked up at Chowdhury and Hyun. Like, because they're so back opposite back voices. That's Namju. Okay. Yes, I do recognize Bomi. She's like the only one that I knew before the group, just because I had seen her on other shows. Sparkle shoes. That's a very interesting dress. Yes. No. Like they're in like a gallery slash museum. Yeah. Like that. For some of it. Yeah. A little bit, yeah. <laughs> it is kind of funny because they're probably in like their like, 20s, like early 30s. Yeah. 
Because they've been out for a minute, right? Um, they debuted in 2011. Yeah. So they've literally second been. Uh, right? <laughs> Go off, Angie. Right? That's super wise, you can't- <laughs> Like, damn. <laughs> the bandana and everything? Yes. It's not my favorite title track. It's a, Frank, I feel like it's, it's a little. It, it's really good. Um, a little too bright for me, I think. Which is really funny because Dilemma. The Dilemma was a little bit dark. A little bit. And sad. Much more it's high like fashion. I love you, but I hate yeah. You. Like this one, I felt like yeah, it's a little more poppy. I really like their choreo though. Their mm -hmm. choreo is really good, and obviously their vocals are gorgeous. Amazing. Um, like they fit on with that high notes pretty well. Yeah. If I'm very honest, this is one of those songs where I'm like, it's easily forgettable for me. Mm -hmm. And I think that's part of the issue. Like, there are certain songs where it's like, you hear it once and you can literally just forget about it. And th that's that's kind of where I'm, I'm feeling it, like this one. And it's nothing against the girls. Like I said, I, I love Dilemma and everything and I really enjoyed that one. But this is just one of those ones, it's a little too poppy- for my taste. A little too Y2K. Yeah. Which, I mean, I'm just saying something, because I do like Y2K stuff, but it's, I don't know, something about this one just was like, it just didn't catch me as much as, like, Dilemma mm -hmm. did. Um, hmm. I definitely still love Hi uh, Hyam's voice. Like, I love her voice. Her voice is so nice. It's so good. She's got that, like I said, that deeper kind of throaty voice that I just, I love. The lower tones. <laughs> I really do. And um, it's like Namju is a little bit of a lower tone. I say I was gonna say Namju was another one that really caught my eye on this one with her voice. I really liked her voice on this one a lot as well. So, because I've never like officially declared a record, mm -hmm. I'm gonna choose one now. It's gonna be Bomi. Yeah. Cause just cause every time I'm like, oh Bomi, hi, <laughs> hello. The see, I knew Bomi before even you like ever listening to Dilemma or whatever you showing me a pink because I have seen Bomi on like uh funny videos like compilation stuff or like on variety things and she's hilarious and that's how I'd recognize her and I recognize her face I'm like that's how I know Bomi but other than that I'm like I, I know nothing else. yeah I was like nope nothing and then you showed me that I was like oh okay and I was like oh that's the group she's from <laughs> that makes sense cat seriously Sorry. That's he, um, no, he took his food out of his dish and left it on the floor. That's not nice. It's a big old chunk. He just left it on the floor. <laughs> Sorry. I can see it in the bathroom from my line of sight. Anyway. Wow. Um, but no, like I said, nothing against the girls. This is a great song for them. They did an amazing job. It's just not my taste. But I applaud them because they did a really good job with it, so... Which is weird, because, like, even their cutesy stuff, which you probably won't like too much, but I feel like you'll agree that it's more memorable than this. Yeah. Um, like I said, I have, we haven't really done, uh, well, she hasn't really, done a deep dive yeah. Into it yet. Yeah, not yet. But, um, we will get around to that eventually, I promise. So we have a lot, a lot of groups we over here. We have so in. many comebacks and So stuff. many. <laughs> um, we're still playing catch-up on a lot of groups that, you know, we already promised to do deep dives on and stuff, so, um, but we will get to them, I promise. Um, but yeah, no, I, I'm definitely looking forward to checking out more from them, because like I said, I really do like their voices a lot, um, so I definitely want to check out more of their music, for I sure. I have two child tracks I know for a fact you're gonna like. Ooh, see? I'm very excited. <laughs> uh, anything else you want to say for this one? No, I'm good. 
All right, guys. Well, we hope you enjoyed the video as much as we did. Go give these girls all the love and support for their comeback. They're amazing. We'll leave a link to our Patreon, Instagram, and our Twitter down below in the description box. We hope you come over and check us out. That really helps us so, so much. Seriously, your support means the absolute, absolute world to us. Welcome to all of our new videos. You guys are seriously amazing. We really love you. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.